Mobile Home Weatherization, an overview of the process. Determine from the audit the total amount of material you will need to construct the sections of insulation to include four-foot access pieces. In the shop, out of the wind and the weather, lay out a 20-foot template to build the sections of sealed insulation. Mark the floor six inches on either side of the 20-foot marks to allow for tabs to seal the ends of the 6 mil plastic sheeting. Roll out the 6 mil plastic to the outer marks of the template and cut it to size. Spread the sheeting out. Don your personal protective equipment, Tyvek suit, respirator with two-stage organic filters, and gloves. Check the seal on your mask. Place your hands over the filters and breathe in. Place one hand over the exhalation valve and blow out. You should not feel air movement at the seal where the respirator touches your face. Open up the area to ventilation and do not work around open flame. Spray the adhesive on the plastic the width of the roll of insulation. Place the roll on the 6 mil 6 inches in from the side and the bottom. One person sprays as the other rolls out the insulation. You should use about four cans of spray adhesive on an entire roll of insulation, making two sections. Cut the roll six inches short of the end of the six mil. Spray the adhesive on approximately four feet of the exposed plastic sheeting. If your can of adhesive stops working, turn the can upside down and spray it. This will clear the nozzle. Turn the can back over and continue to apply the glue. With a person on each end, flip the insulation onto the other side of the 6 mil. Lay down some more glue and fold over the top, leaving a tab to be used to secure the insulation to the mobile home. To seal the ends, spray adhesive on the inside of the 6 mil sheeting and press the two sides together. Add some more adhesive and fold the edge over and secure it with staples. One section down. Cut down a roll of insulation if you do not need the entire four feet and follow the same procedure. Lay out the plastic and cut it. Apply adhesive and roll out the insulation. Cut it, add some more adhesive, and flip it. Make the tab at the top and seal the ends. Use up as much of the scrap as you can. The short ends of the insulation roll can also be used to wrap ducts. Funding for this video comes from the Department of Energy. This video was produced at the Energy Saving Partners Studio at SunPower.